Today we're looking at why are people moving to Redondo Beach, California? What's up everybody, Shane Inman here, local real estate agent in Southern California and helping families move here from all over the country, all over the world. So if that's you and you're looking to move to the South Bay, be sure to reach out. I'd love to help you get started in your home search. Um, and today we're gonna kind of look at what you might be thinking about when you're looking to move to the South Bay, specifically Redondo Beach. And so I've had a lot of people um, reach out about moving here recently. And so I just kind of wanted to go over some of the key reasons why people are moving here. Uh, one of them being right here over my shoulder, obviously the beach. So uh, you've got beach in the name and that obviously makes it a very intriguing place to go. And so uh, many people are moving here for the beach, but there's a lot of other reasons too. So let's check out some of the others. All right, so as I mentioned, uh, the beach life is really a key factor in why people move to Redondo Beach. Um, but it's not just the access to the beach, it's really the community and the vibe that the beach life brings. So, um, you know, it's very walkable. You've got people out walking and running, riding bikes. Um, so, you know, it's uh, definitely a community of outdoorsiness. Um, you're close to trails, you're close to the beach, you're close to uh, paths for running and walking. So you've got the strand that goes down south from Redondo, um, all the way down in the south towards Torrance and Palos Verdes, all the way up north through Manhattan Beach, Redondo Beach, Hermosa Beach, uh, all the way up into Santa Monica. So you can get a good ride in, run in. Um, so the outdoorsiness in the community is a key factor in what makes people want to move to Redondo Beach. I'm outside here, Redondo Union High School, and uh, this is kind of one of the key contributors for people moving to Redondo Beach. Um, as you look on niche.com, it has a A plus uh, rating for schools. So obviously in Southern California, you've got a bunch of different options for schools. You've got private schools, you've got public schools. And um, I often have people reaching out uh, saying that the reason that they're moving here is for the public schools and the ratings that they um, have online. So um, do your research, figure out uh, you know, what fits your needs, but um, Redondo Union is the main high school in town, and then you've got uh, the feeder schools that feed in there. Uh, Redondo Union is a pretty large campus. Uh, it's got, uh, it's, I think it's the second largest uh, campus on in the U.S., so um, you've got a lot of space here. You're pretty, you know, about a half mile to the beach, so uh, the lifestyle of being a high schooler here is probably a pretty good uh, spot to be. The next big driver I see for people moving to Redondo Beach is just the accessibility. You've got, uh, you know, this is North Redondo right now, and you've got um, pretty good accessibility to get to the freeway. And then from there, you've got, uh, you know, not too from, far from the beach. So a lot of options um, if you're commuting to downtown or you're commuting um, to get out of the South Bay. Uh, Redondo Beach is a good option. And like I said, North Redondo, you can get some townhomes with a little bit bigger space. Uh, then in South Redondo, you're getting maybe, um, you know, obviously closer to the beach. And then depending on your price range, it's either going to be um, kind of an older style or a remodeled home. So uh, Redondo Beach definitely has the accessibility of getting to other places and also being uh, in the South Bay and close to the beach. So along with, uh, you know, the accessibility of the South Bay and Redondo Beach, you have, um, you know, people moving here for jobs. And so, you know, I meet a lot of engineers, people working at Boeing or SpaceX or Northrop or Chevron. Um, you know, we've got uh, UCLA, uh, Harbor, uh, Harbor City Medical. You've got, um, you know, all types of different uh, companies in the area hiring and so I think that's a big uh, driver to the area as well. This right here is Riviera Village. Riviera Village, although uh, you know, it may not be something that is uh, necessarily driving people to moving here, I do think it's a really cool spot in uh, the South Bay in Redondo Beach. So you've got these uh, stores and restaurants and everything all lined up on the street. Um, during COVID, uh, they'd moved a lot of outdoor dining out to the street. So you've got a lot of uh, different food spots lined along the main street here. And then 
Um, you know, you can hit up a restaurant, you can go shopping in some of the little stores, and then you're right down the street from the ocean. So I think that's kind of a key um, spot to check out when you're in Redondo Beach. Uh, obviously in Redondo Beach, you've got a lot of sections of the beach you can go check out, but uh, the, you know, Riviera Village section of town is a great spot because you've got the restaurants just blocks away from the beach. All right, so that is Redondo Beach. Thanks for checking it out with me. Uh, if you are thinking of moving to the South Bay or Redondo or anywhere in the area, feel free to reach out, give me a call or text or email, and I'd love to help you get started in your next move.